Hey everyone, today's June 9th and uh, day four for HCG for me. And I just want to give you a recap of my day. Uh, it started off, actually, I want to go back to last night after I stopped filming last night. Uh, I was feeling pretty good. Uh, I actually started getting a little hungry again after dinner, but it was time to go to bed and I was pretty tired. But, uh, and against what I was instructed to do at the clinic, I went and weighed myself at the, uh, the end of the evening after dinner and everything. Uh, it turns out I had actually lost uh, almost a pound from the beginning of the day, despite having drank a gallon of water and ate all the food. Um, so I was pretty pleased about that. And went to sleep, woke up the next day, got back on the scale, and I had actually lost a couple more. And I'll show you the board where I'm recording or uh, tracking all that stuff down. Um, so I was going to start weighing myself in the morning and in the evening. Most people will tell you not to do that because if you know your weight fluctuates, you might not always, you might not always lose, and it stresses you out and raises uh, certain levels of hormones in your body. It might actually prevent you from losing weight. Um, but you know what? If for some reason this my goal wasn't achieved in this first round. I'll just go to a second round. It's no big deal. So I'm not that stressed out about it at all. Um, actually, I'm fairly confident. So to start the day, I uh, woke up fully energized. I got a great night's sleep. Um, I wasn't hungry at all. And I rushed around and I got out to my car and I was about to drive away and realized I didn't give myself the injection. I didn't take the uh, potassium chloride or the phenamine. So I had to get back out of the car, go back inside. Um, you know, I was already dressed and I've normally been giving myself the injections in the legs and I wasn't about to, uh, you know, pull my pants down for that. I was already late. So I just injected it into my forearm, actually, into the muscle that runs right here. Um, I figured, you know, you're just trying to get into a muscle group anyways. So uh, I just did it right here and it was no big deal. Uh, you know, didn't hurt or anything like that. Bled a little bit more, and I got a little tiny bruise, uh, but that was it. So I guess if you're in a pinch and you're in a hurry and you can't inject yourself in your leg, you just inject yourself wherever you can find a muscle. Uh, throughout the day, hardly got hungry at all. Uh, had my snack, felt just fine. Had my lunch, again, couldn't finish it right away. Um, had my orange and everything was great. I went to the gym. I did uh, the tread climber again for an hour and it was very slow two and a half miles an hour I mean that's slower than most people walk normally um, still managed to burn just about 700 calories according to the machine uh, and then also against what the clinic advised I lifted weights um, because one of my biggest fears is that yes I, I drop a bunch of weight but then I have no muscle to show underneath it uh, not that I have a whole lot of muscle now but I like to keep what I have um, but I did start to feel myself getting kind of weak and I stopped, so there you go. Uh, tonight for dinner, I had my three and a half ounces of chicken breast and I put a little garlic powder on there and I had um, cauliflower raw with the Walden Farms dressing. Not bad, but I actually felt bloated after eating that. And you wouldn't think, especially after just having loading days where I ate nonstop, that that would happen, but it did. So right now I actually feel really, really full. And um, the only reason I continue to eat is because I did burn so much energy at the gym that uh, you know I don't want to run out of gas too soon in this thing. Um, so I'm gonna show you my board here where I'm just kind of recording stuff. So I thought, you know, it makes sense to track this kind of stuff. So you can see day one and day two there. Uh, oddly, as much as I picked out on day one, I actually lost weight uh, and then promptly gamed it all back the next day. So day three is the first day of the low calorie diet. I started off at 214 and then at night after everything I was 213 uh, and then this morning I was down to 210 and this is just from about nine o'clock at night till five o'clock in the morning. I haven't recorded it for today. I gotta admit 
as, as full as I feel, I don't even want to get on the scale, but I will, uh, just for the sake of continuity in these videos. Uh, it looks like I also got a few more comments and a few more people subscribed, and that's fantastic. And it looks like everyone's on track. Everyone's uh, doing their own program also. So, you know, if you come on board and you see com see comments, why don't you pay a visit to their sites also? Uh, give them some encouragement. You know, we can all use it. And it seems like um, people are just doing fantastic on this program. So uh, I encourage everyone to just kind of share the love, so to speak, and uh, frequent every, everyone else's YouTube sites and, and uh, give them the encouragement that they might want.